hello everyone and welcome back to the kashish mishra green future channel and uh, hello uh, again i'm back with this digestion and absorption i started up with these series um, i think before also but only thing was that i found a better way to come to you and uh, this time you know i i have this personal habit of always writing myself right so even when i'm teaching to you i'm like um, if and if i'm not writing i don't get that feel so that i'm not getting even now because i wrote them earlier and now i am uh, bringing up here but at least one good point will be that i'll ensure that each and every point is being covered here and none is being left out right so though earlier also there was nothing left out and if left out was covered in the next video but then here there will be no concept of like covering up because we'll be doing everything here itself so digestion and absor uh, absorption let's begin with this beautiful chapter the digestion uh, the system of your own body digestion and absorption now before you go anywhere before you see anything the first thing okay the very first thing that we have to go with okay so the very first thing you have to go with you have to see nothing kuch mat dekho bas meri baat suno फूड कॉम्पोनेंट्स में दो चीजें होती हैं एक या आपका मेजर कॉम्पोनेंट एक होता है कह सकते हैं माइनर कॉम्पोनेंट नॉट रियली माइनर कॉम्पोनेंट आप कहीं देखो कि नहीं उसको ऐसा लिखा हुआ माइनर कॉम्पोनेंट बट समहाउ यस दे आर माइनर कॉम्पोनेंट फाइन सो वी हैव दिस मेजर कॉम्पोनेंट एंड माइनर कॉम्पोनेंट आई थिंक आई कैन हैव अ पेन एटलीस्ट राइट चल ओके digestion and absorption okay so uh, food components we have two categories major and we have minor and um, in major we have basically carbohydrate protein fat vitamins and minerals in the minor category ab humne carbohydrate protein fat ko major category mein rakha hai humne bachpan se even i think we started up with this concept of digestion and everything in the fourth class and from there itself i think we have been studying up or we have always been studying about this um you know uh, carbohydrate protein and fat as the major components of the food and they are uh, called to be the proximate principles of food right bas इतना ही बोला मैंने अभी कि मेजर में आपका कार्बोहाइड्रेट जाता है आपका प्रोटीन जाता है आपका फैट जाता है बस ये तीन कैटेगरी हैं ठीक है आपके माइनर में आते हैं विटामिन एंड मिनरल्स कूल एंड वेन यू आर टॉकिंग अबाउट द मिनरल्स इफ इवन दे गो इन टू टू कैटेगरीज द मैक्रो एलिमेंट्स एंड द माइक्रो एलिमेंट्स इसके बारे में आप खुद इलेवेंथ में पढ़ोगे मिनरल एंड न्यूट्रिशन में आधे तो पढ़ भी चुके होंगे सो देर आर ट्वेंटी इसेंशियल देर आर ट्वेंटी इसेंशियल विटामिन राइट ट्वेंटी इसेंशियल मीन्स बेसिकली इम्पॉर्टेंट विच वी विच वी विच वी रियली नीड राइट सो so, चाहिए तो सारे होते हैं बट ट्वेंटी आर इसेंशियल अब आपके मिनरल्स जाते हैं मैक्रो एलिमेंट में और माइक्रो एलिमेंट में मैं कह रही थी आप मिनरल एंड न्यूट्रिशन के बारे में पढ़ोगे पढ़ोगे बट आप पढ़ोगे एलिमेंट्स के बारे में यू विल स्टडी देर राइट जब मैक्रो एलिमेंट्स की बात करते हैं ट्वेंटी वन मैक्रो एलिमेंट्स हैं इनका मतलब ये हमें अच्छी क्वान्टिटी में चाहिए जो कि हैं लेट मी राइट हेयर हंड्रेड एम जी in 100 mg we need them right and they are kahoni papa okay so this is just a trick kahoni papa so it's basically carbon hydrogen oxygen nickel and phosphorus good enough so we are having basically these three let me undo them so this was your trick for uh, learning them एंड आयरन आयोडीन जिंक आर एग्जाम्पल ऑफ माइक्रो एलिमेंट्स एनी प्रॉब्लम चल रहा हूँ कुछ नहीं कहा मैंने मैंने बस छोटी सी बात कही है कि आपकी कार्बोहाइड्रेट प्रोटीन फैट मेजर कॉम्पोनेंट्स आपके विटामिन और मिनरल्स हैं माइनर कॉम्पोनेट माइनर कॉम्पोनेंट उसमें भी मेजर कॉम्पोनेंट्स जो हैं वो आपके अप्रॉक्सीमेट प्रिंसिपल्स ऑफ फूड हैं विटामिन एंड मिनरल भी चाहिए बट दे आर नॉट एनर्जी गिविंग फूड्स राइट and when you go for mineral they have macro, macro elements and micro elements macro elements may we have 21 important macro elements those are 
C H O N I P Kahuni Papa Dead. This is just an example, okay? I give you a few examples. You need 21 years, nahi hai, which you are very well aware. So, Kahuni Papa, this is my way for learning. You go for air, anyone. Carbon, hydrogen, oxygen, nickel, and phosphorus. Micro elements are iron and zinc. Now, okay. First, let me erase everything so that anyone who wants to take screenshot has to go. I will make your notes. Now, we will go to the same way. This will not go away from us. Okay? So, we will go to the same way. Now, we will go to the same way. Now, we will go to the same way. And you will hear my story and write it. And what you will do is you will take a reference. Let's go. Digestive system. First of all, what is it? There is an elementary canal and an associated gland. You will also write an associated gland. It will go. It will go. It is just your elementary canal and your glands. Now, I will start. How do you start this elementary canal? It goes from your mouth to your buccal cavity to your oral cavity. In your oral cavities, you are going to have your teeth and tongue. Your teeth and tongue are not in the buccal cavity. In the oral cavity. ठीक है अब ये teeth अकेला नहीं होता इसके इसके जब आप इसके बारे में पढ़ोगे तो आप dentition के बारे में पढ़ोगे आपकी human dentition heterodont है heterodont है diphyodont है bunodont है thicodont है समझोगे क्या है कुछ नहीं सुना तुमने अभी तक बस अब मेरी बात सुनो हमारे teeth हैं क्या ये ऊपर ऊपर लगे हुए क्या ये जॉबोन के ऐसे ऊपर मतलब ये मेरी जॉबोन और ये इसके बिल्कुल ऊपर लगे हुए ऐसा नहीं है ये इसके अंदर हैं दे आर डीप सीटेड इनटू इट राइट सो दे आर बेसिकली थिकोनॉन राइट दैट दे आर एम्बिडेड इन योर जॉबोन राइट एंड व्हेन यू आर गोइंग फॉर हेट्रोडॉन दैट देयर आर डिफरेंट टाइप्स ऑफ टीथ ऐसा नहीं है कि सिर्फ एक एक ही वैरायटी का है दे आर इंसेजर दे आर अकेनाइंस दे आर प्रीमोलर्स दे आर मोलर्स वी हैव डायफायोडॉन दैट इज आपके टीथ टू बारी रिप्लेस होते हैं लाइफ में वो we know this milk teeth and permanent teeth bunodont is okay we have it this is a new term i missed out a diagram no problem let's have it here this is your teeth okay and this is your cusp this type of dentition is bunodont और हम देख सकते हैं अपने रात में ऐसी कोई बड़ी बात नहीं कि we have not seen it चलो then dentition we have studied बहुत ही simple terms हैं कि हमारे बड़े variety के दांत होते हैं जैसे insert के नाइन free molar molar इसलिए हम इसको इसको heterodont बोलते हैं and फिर diphyodont क्योंकि हमारे दो sets of teeth होते हैं bunodont क्योंकि they have cusp thicodont because they are deep seated into the jaw bones अब मैंने बहुत ही ना सुंदर सा diagram बनाया ये देखो डेंटल फॉर्मूला होता क्या है ये एक्सप्लेन करने के लिए डेंटल फॉर्मूला क्या होता है वो देख लेना अभी पर डेंटल फॉर्मूला ही क्या होता है वो देखते हैं अभी द अरेंजमेंट ऑफ टीथ इन द हाफ जॉ इन द ऑर्डर इन सिज़र के नाइन प्री मोलर मोलर इज़ नोन एस डेंटल फॉर्मूला विल बी रिपीट अगेन इट इज़ दैट द अरेंजमेंट ऑफ टीथ इन द हाफ जॉ बोन बोन इन द ऑर्डर इन सिज़र के नाइन प्री मोलर मोलर इज़ नोन एस डेंटल फॉर्मूला नाउ व्हाट इज़ द डेंटल फॉर्मूला फॉर एडल्ट्स टू वन टू थ्री टू वन टू थ्री टू वन टू थ्री टू वन टू थ्री ओके नाउ नोटिस यहाँ से लेकर यहाँ तक ठीक है मेरा कंप्लीट है मैंने माना कि यहाँ से लेकर यहाँ तक का आधा है ठीक है सपोज तो यहाँ से यहाँ तक का जो है वो इस ऑर्डर में इंसिजर कैनाइन प्री मोलर मोलर डू इट विद योर सेल्फ इंसिजर कैनाइन प्री मोलर मोलर इन दिस ऑर्डर ठीक है और है क्या टू इंसिजर वन कैनाइन टू प्री मोलर थ्री मोलर is known as insignine premolar molar dental formula for your half अब मैंने इनको two का क्योंकि नीचे भी है फिर मैं इनको double कर देती हूँ ताकि यहाँ के भी आ जाए तो total कितने हो जाते हैं ये अपन के two two this will give you sixteen 
8, 8 will give you 16. Now 16 plus 16 is 32. Exactly what I said, you'll find in the definition, okay? The, um, exactly what I said you are going to find in this definition. See this, the arrangement of teeth in the in each jaw in the order incisor canine premolar molar is known as dental formula okay and simple aapko mujhe jaldi se batayega child ka dental formula this is your task this is your task this is your task comment abhi 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 batana hai ki dental formula of child ye baat yaad rakh lo ki unke paas premolar nahi hote aur um Incisor two you one canine and premolar hote nahi molar two you hote hain. Ab gin lo. Ab iske aage nahi bataun. Iske aage bata diya. Toh main toh sab mein toh sab bata diya. Revision karenge ham. Bilkul karenge. Kya padha tha humne? Dentition thi heterodont, bade saare diaphragont, do baad bunodont, cusp thicodont, deep seated. Incisor canine premolar molar dental formula. Arrangement of teeth in the half jaw bone in the order is an incisor canine premolar molar is known as dental formula. Incisor canine premolar molar. Dental formula of the child. Here it is. 2102. You can have a premolar. Now, what do you have to do? I have to do it. Be honest. Hmm? Do write down in comment whether yours was correct or not. Hard. This is your teeth, and these are your hard chewing surface of the uh, on the teeth. It is known as enamel, and these enamel. This enamel is secreted by the ameloblast cell, which I have not written here. But these ameloblast cells are ectodermal in er origin. Ecto. Dermal. Ectodermal in. Origin. I have to write it and write it and write it. Let's go. But these are seriously, I mean this is the best version, best thing I am providing you. I mean seriously, incisor canine, premolar, molar. Sorry. These handwritten notes I am giving you. These like this is the best version of me I can present you. I am in front of you and I have written everything. So that's really best of me I am giving to you now your tongue is a voluntary glandular and a muscular organ muscular organ mein iske paas skeletal muscles hoti hai mein se question na mein ko tum se poochna chahe tha to even our teacher asked and we guys replied that they are you know give it so basically they are skeletal muscles and as they are voluntary and we know that skeletal muscles are under our control we can move them right we can move them so um now see this tongue see this tongue this is your sulcus terminalis this is your sulcus not sulcus this is your sulcus terminalis okay Sulcus terminalis. Good. Sulcus terminalis. This divides in tongue into two part: oral cavity and the pharyngeal portion. And in the pharyngeal portion, see, I have located some papillaries. Though these are not the accurate position of your papillaries, I might show you the position of papillaries, and you can search them yourself. The foliate papillae is not present in the human beings only the filiform family and the filiform papillae and the fungiform papillae are present in your tongue and the most the, the most in number are the filiform papillae they do not have the taste buds whereas your fungiform papillae are the you know um they are red dots which have the taste buds good enough now foliate papillae i told you it's uh, absent in human being one more thing the sweat glands this is not written here not written i love to write sweat glands in dogs are on the tongue is ka proof
पैंटिंग ऑफ डॉग्स पैंटिंग ऑफ डॉग्स ठीक है चलो बहुत बहुत अच्छी प्यारी राइटिंग है ये अब इससे ज़्यादा अच्छी राइटिंग मिली तो हम आउट ऑफ यूट्यूब चलो सो फैरिंग्स अब ठीक है फैरिंग्स पैसेज फूड एंड एयर फैरिंग्स इज द कॉमन पैसेज फॉर द फूड एंड एयर दिस इज हाउ यू आर गोइंग टू लर्न फर्स्ट है फैरिंग्स ठीक है फूड और एयर का कॉमन पैसेज आपका जो ईसो जो फैरिंग्स है वो ईसोफेगस में चला जाएगा ईसोफेगस क्या है थिन लॉन्ग ट्यूब ठीक है ग्लॉटिस जो है आपकी ओपनिंग है विंड पाइप की उसके ग्लॉटिस के ऊपर एपी ग्लॉटिस लगा है ठीक है इट्स अ कार्टिलेजनियस लैप very simple things nothing no rocket science here and um, now but your esophagus this your thin long tube is going to go inside your j shaped bag that is called the stomach when the esophagus um, uh, uh, enters the stomach it basically enters into the cardiac region there are certain regions in your stomach those are basically fundus cardiac body pyloric these are certain regions and your esophagus enters into the cardiac portion of your stomach good enough and it's regulated by the gastroesophageal uh, sphincter and um it's regulated by the gastroesophageal sphincter and um no i have not raised up my specs to give a look anyhow actually i was not able to see clearly i don't know why so gastroesophageal sphincter and Where is your stomach located? Your stomach is located in the upper left portion of your abdomen. Good enough. And then, ah, uh, I have told you already the four regions and ah uh, fundus, cardiac, body, pyloric. Who will love to tell me? I have already told this, though I should not ask. But um, I'll be asking that um, which is the portion in which your esophagus enters? Okay, so your answer should come cardiac, and then your um. fundus body peach ke pyloric it enters into the small intestine this is the first part to get into the small intestine okay um i think with this we are ending up our first portion for all the, for all those who wants to take screenshot these like i'm giving you these handwritten notes please take the screenshot Anyone who wants me to give them this, um, you know, basically, um, uh, quick review again. You, अभी भी चेक करोगे अपने notes. Digestion, absorption, food के अंदर components होते हैं. Major component, major, minor component. Major component में आपके carbohydrate, protein, fat आ जाते हैं. Minor में आपके vitamins and mineral आ जाते हैं. Vitamins twenty होते हैं. Mineral में we have macro elements and min, uh, and we have um, micro elements. Macro elements में we basically require them in the hundred mg quantity. They are the twenty one. I have given you for examples कहूँगी पापा. So yeah, we have learned them. Uh, it's a mnemonic. And uh, then we come to the digestive gland system, which has basically entry mana entry element. Canal and associated glands and mouth goes on to the buccal cavity, oral cavity. Oral cavity has teeth and tongue. Your dentition is heterodont, diphthodont, buonodont, thicodont. I have told you all the meanings. See, see the definition of the dental formula. Okay, and understand. Take it logically. The arrangement of teeth in the upper, in the half jaw, in the order. And this is the canine premolar molar is known as then uh, is known as dental. Formula. Now, uh, the hard chewing surface on the teeth is known as enamel. It's secreted by the ameloblastal, which are ectodermal in origin, which I just told you. Tongue, uh, bas- tongue is basically voluntary organ. Glandula are called because they give out some sing- secretions, and um, they are muscular organ and have the skeletal muscles. And that um, your tongue is attached to the floor in your mouth by frenulum, and in your tongue we have the sulcus terminalis, which is dividing your tongue into the oral part and the pharyngeal portion. We have talked about the two fa- papillaries, fungi form and filiform. form. Just miss a taste buds. Kis ke pas hai? Fungi form ke pas. Fungi hamara saara khana karab karta hai. Isi fungi form ke pas. Okay, learn in this way. Foliate papillae are is absent in human being. Pharynx is passage for food and air esophagus is a thin long tube and um glottis is the opening of windpipe and epiglottis on glottis it's a cartilaginous flap esophagus into opens uh, into the stomach by this gastroesophageal sphincter and um this opens up into the cardiac region we have three more region fundus body and pyloric 
pyloric is the first one to enter into the small intestine with this we end our first part and the next one we'll be starting up with the small intestine keep on liking sharing and subscribing my videos channel rather for uh, you know getting such more updates quickly and do set, tell me in comments what you really want okay thank you